Hey, what's up everyone? Vortex here and welcome back to another video in 7 days to die. Guys, today we're gonna talk about Demolishers. I've been watching uh, Jawoodle's uh, series, uh, Demolishers Only, and uh, he mentioned a couple of times that he didn't want to use the SMG turrets in his horde base because uh, they would trigger the Demolishers. Uh, he didn't want to use like uh, junk turrets or explosions. And I've been thinking to myself, like, I remember back in Alpha 19, that used to be a case, right? where uh, you would use traps and they would trigger the demolishers but alpha 20 came and right from the beginning the fun pimps they removed that from the game so the traps they wouldn't trigger the demolishers anymore but since then we had a lot of patches for alpha 20 now we're back in alpha 21 we had a lot of uh, patches for this one as well so i'm not sure if they change anything uh, maybe ja Woodle, he he's right and he knows what he's talking about or he doesn't know that that's not a thing anymore in the game where uh, the demolisher would be triggered by uh, by traps so today we're, that's what we're gonna do we're gonna test all of this shit here uh, let me throw one of this we're gonna t uh, test like um, throwables uh, smg turrets landmines uh, dart traps rocket launchers everything and we'll see which one it's uh, safe to use and which one is a no-no <laughs> so yeah that's what we're gonna do today guys uh if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe if you want to support the channel even more you can uh, become a member you can press the join button and you become a member and support the channel for more content and uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy what uh, what i'm doing here for you because this is not just for me to learn how this works for the demolition but it's for you guys as well uh, if you wonder what you should do, <laughs> you know. So let's start with the uh, blade traps. Now I put two blade traps here. They should be at nipple area, <laughs> okay, and trigger the the button for the demolishers. I hope I put together this uh, small base really quick. It's all made of uh, steel, except for the fighting position, which is concrete. And this way, the zombies they won't go and beat into my supports. They would come hopefully straight to the fighting position so let's uh, spawn a couple of them uh, let's start with one and then we'll see how it works and let's see what happens come on be faster okay <laughs> come on stop doing that shit it doesn't look like uh, the blade trap is triggering the button so i'm pretty sure that's safe to use Okay, so the blade trap uh, it's working actually <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's double test and uh, try with maybe two or three uh, one more please okay that uh, is broken sorry sorry all right <laughs> uh, okay so the blade trap is working that guy died for some reason why did you die <laughs> maybe he's tired He's been chopping trees all day. <laughs> all right. Okay. So yeah, I did. I'm not gonna try the um, the electric fences because I know for sure they're working. I saw uh, Ja Woodle using them, so they're not gonna trigger the zombies for sure. Uh, the demolishers. Sorry. Uh, let's uh, test uh, now. Uh, let's see which one would. Let's test the dart trap actually. So give me a couple of seconds, guys. I'm gonna uh, put together these uh, dart traps and then I will come back to you and. Uh, show you what i'm doing all right guys so i put a bunch of uh, dart traps here we have two in front two down and two up right and this way if these ones they don't hit the nipple at least if they come here they might be triggered by this one or either this one okay and uh, we'll see if the dart trap is working i put them all on uh, these cameras here <laughs> with trigger motion so hopefully they will work i think i've done it a bit wrong but that's fine i don't care I just want it to work, you know. Let's spawn a couple of them. Three of them, maybe? Yeah, let's see what's going on. <laughs> okay, come on. Okay, it doesn't look like... It triggers them. Again, I could have done this a little bit better, but I'm okay with this. Alright, no. The dark traps are safe as well. I can say that for sure. I'm being weird. Alright, so, yeah. 
<laughs> Alright guys, so it's working. Dart traps are safe, 100%. I'm curious about the SMG because that was the one that triggered me because, again, uh, Jawudol was saying, ah, don't use that one because it will uh, trigger uh, the demolishers. So that's the one that I'm curious the most. So that's what I'm gonna do now. All right, so now we have the SMG turrets. I actually forgot that you don't need a motion sensor to <laughs> activate the SMG turrets. All right, so let's spawn another three of them. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> you guys need to die. All right, so the SMG turret is working. Oh, there's a screamer here. Hello. <laughs> okay, so it's safe to say guys that Jawodal is a bit wrong. I don't think he actually knows that this is not a thing anymore. Okay, let's get rid of you. The electric fence, I know it's working because I saw uh, Jawodal using them. So they didn't trigger the demolishers. The blade traps are safe. The SMGs are safe. So let's uh, go for the robotic turrets. Okay, now we can have two of them. And also let me grab some uh, ammo for it. I gotta take the regular one. All right, so let me put some blocks here all right so we have them here now let's see if the the junk turrets they will trigger the demolishers okay let's uh, take another three come on let's see what's going on here Okay, so the junk turret actually triggers the demolishers. I didn't know that. I thought uh, they removed that one from the game. <laughs> okay, that's good to know. So make sure if you have uh, your horror base and you have uh, uh, junkies next to you, don't uh, <laughs> don't use them, right? Junk turret, it's a big no-no. Now, wait, I'm gonna put this here. Let's test the robotic sledge. Let's see if he actually works the same way. One of you here. And one of you, uh, where is it? Here. Right, let's see if uh, it happens the same shit. I suppose it will, I'm not sure. Uh, okay, let's... Uh, let's spawn them again. Come on. Right? Maybe not. We need to die. Okay, I'm not sure, but <laughs> they don't really do much, right? Actually, let's do something else because they break through this shit too quick. <laughs> I want them to take a little bit long longer. Let's try again. Maybe just with one of them. Come on, dude, be faster. Maybe I should have put them to run. Oh, oh, okay. All right, so <laughs> the sledge turret is uh, triggering them. Okay, <laughs> that's good to know. You see, it's good that we are testing all of this shit because I didn't know that. I know it was before. I thought they removed it, uh, but no, <laughs> it still works. Okay, so this one, a uh, no-no. I mean, you can use them if you want, but <laughs> let's uh, test some landmines now. See if uh, these explosions will trigger them. Uh, let's take uh, two of them. I don't think anyone would use uh, landmines <laughs> in the horde base, but you know, it's nice to know if, uh, for example, if you're in a POI, if there's a landmines, what will happen? Okay. All right, so landmines <laughs> triggers them. Okay, that's good to know. Also, I'm I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure uh, contact grenades and stuff like that uh, is the same shit, right? Let's uh, test it. Okay, was that because I hit uh, his nipple or because it was the explosion? Let's try again. Maybe it was because of the explosion. Uh, because I hit the nipple. I'm not entirely sure. 
I need to replace some of these blocks. I need to I need to try again. Because I'm not sure. Maybe I just uh, hit uh, the button and that's why it exploded. Uh, let's see. Let's try again. Just two of them. Come on. Uh, let's go into normal mode. I'm gonna try to avoid the... To hit the, nip, the button. So it's not the explosion. Okay? You can see that it's not the explosion. It's all about uh, hitting... I mean, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about this one. Uh, it's a bit confusing because it didn't look like I hit uh, the button and yet he exploded. So this one, uh, I would say it's a question mark. <laughs> Man, this uh, base uh, <laughs> is going down really quick. But we're almost done anyway. So what we're going to test now, it's a rocket launcher. <laughs> Obviously, let me spawn some of them. Yo, you fuckers. Come here. I'm here. I'm here. Where are you going? Why are you being an idiot? I'm gonna try to hit like legs or something, so... Uh... For sure I didn't hit the nipple, right? The button. I keep saying nipple because I'm talking like fucking Jawodel. <laughs> uh, I hit... I didn't hit the button. I hit his leg. And yet the explosion of... Uh... Of the rocket launcher killed him. Alright, that's... Uh, that's interesting. Well... Uh... Let's try some contact grenades and see how they work. I'm gonna do this right here. Did I hit the nipple first? No, this is the explosion for sure. Okay, so no grenades. <laughs> and uh, no rocket launcher the exploding arrows i would say there's a question mark to that one maybe the explosion would trigger them or maybe it's all about where you hit them because i let, let actually let's uh, let's double test it again uh just for my uh safety and sanity let's spawn a couple of them over there i took their legs so you see it's not the explosion you can Uh, <laughs> I don't know. When they were down there, but maybe because I hit them in the in the button. Okay, this one it's a weird one. I'm not sure about this one. Uh, let's uh, let's try the pipe bombs. Actually, let's try the grenade as well. Man, we're making a mess here, right? Ah, uh, that one it's uh, takes a little bit. Less, so let's put it here. Okay, so definitely grenades will trigger them. Uh, so it's safe to say that pipe bombs will do the same, right? Yes. <laughs> we are reshaping the whole the world here. <laughs> okay. Um, let me try one one more thing. Molotovs, I don't think they will trigger, but anyway, we will try them. Actually, we didn't try the time charge. Let's see the time charge if it actually triggers them. And also the molotovs. Um, what was the other one? The dynamite? And the time charge. Okay. So let's... Uh, I don't think the fire will trigger them. But... Because I saw Jaw Woodle using it, so... Yeah, the fire is safe. Oh. Obviously, if you hit them with the button... <laughs> you can still uh, trigger them. So it's all about... I suppose it's the same with the exploding arrows, right? It's all about uh, where you hit them with the arrows. While the grenades and the pipe bombs and stuff like that, they actually... It's just the explosion that triggers them, right? Come on, dude. You need to fucking die. Okay, I had enough of you. Alright, um... Let's try the time charge. Can I stick it to you? Yes. <laughs> Let's see. 
Alright, so the time charge is the same. <laughs> Why am I having fun? <laughs> okay, let's uh, try the dynamite. I don't I know for sure it will trigger. Ooh. What happened with them? Alright. That was weird. Oh, uh, interesting. Okay, so dynamite doesn't trigger them. Okay, all right, we just found out something interesting, right? I mean, <laughs> you wouldn't use the dynamite during a, a horde fight, right? During the horde night. But let's say you're out and about, like uh, for example, Jawudul, he could use this one, like, no problem, yeah? A bunch of uh, sticks of dynamite, he could use them. Let's uh, take uh, like a lot of them and see. Let's see. Wait. Now we trigger them. Hmm. Okay, that was weird. The first time it didn't look like it was the uh, trigger there, but now, okay. The third time is the charm, right? Let's try again. Now it doesn't trigger them. What's going on here? And now it is. Hmm. Okay, this one it's a tricky one. Again. Just like the exploding arrows. Man, look at this. Oh, you. Let's see. Look, it triggered. Hmm. Okay. So I don't know about the dynamite. It looks like uh, it might work sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't. All right, guys. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we should uh, try. I think we've tried everything. I, we know the weapons, like uh, they will trigger them for sure. So there's no reason for me to try those. All right. So yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> we did a lot of work here with, uh, with the ground. We have a lot of uh, loot bags everywhere <laughs> so let's uh talk about everything again so smg turrets uh i suppose shotgun turrets will be the same just like the smg turrets uh I, there's no reason for me to try those as well they don't trigger uh the zombies so jaudel it's wrong <laughs> when he says he doesn't want to use them in his horde base is because maybe he doesn't know <laughs> blade traps safe to use uh, electric fences for sure they're safe to use even though we didn't test them here like i said jaudal was using them in uh, in his horde base and they were working perfectly what else uh, is working dart traps they work uh, perfectly they don't trigger them so pretty much all these traps they they are safe to use in terms of explosions all the throwables except uh, the molotov will trigger them so grenades uh, pipe bombs uh, landmines uh, the rocket launcher will trigger them and then we have a little bit of um, confusion let's say exploding arrows they might trigger them or maybe not maybe it depends where you hit them but the explosion itself i don't think actually triggers them and the dynamite as well it's uh, it's a little tricky one i'm not sure maybe sometimes it's working and you can actually use it even though again i don't think you want to use a dynamite to but maybe, like for example, in Jawudu's case, when there's a huge amount of uh, demolishers around him, he could throw one dynamite and, uh, <laughs> you know, get rid of them. And the exploding arrows, like I said, it depends maybe where you hit them. And also, uh, the junk turret and the sledge turret, uh, they're a big no-no. <laughs> they will trigger the demolishers straight away. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> I know I did. Uh, if you did, please like and subscribe. And if you want to support the channel even more, you can become a member by uh, pressing the join button. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.